And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Elche facing Barcelona. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. The line-up then for the hosts. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers, and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And they kick off here. Will he play it in? Gives it a go. Well, what a start that was. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, nothing comes of it. It's opening up for them. And Torres on the ball. It comes to nothing in the end. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. technique but no reward sadly for him yeah he's hit it really well but i think he knew it was always going past the post he's unlucky though always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game but you could make a strong case for this man i think stuart what are you expecting to see from him well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. As a go! Oh, excellent diving stop. Played over. And the danger's still on. Good physical play. Mascarel. And how about that for a save? Can someone get on the end of this? And he's clear as lines. The referee's letting it go. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how on earth he got there.
And over it comes. And he didn't miss by a massive margin at all. Pedri. Promising attack, this. Surely! And a goal here. No surprise that the first of the night should come from Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be and he didn't hesitate good thing too well he's so quick off his line that's great goalkeeping you have to say Tempele and the cross goes in and the no-nonsense clearance well read to ease the pressure Absolutely spot on, and they keep the ball. Obama Yang just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Denied by the bar, back in play here. And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save, and then the recovery. chance to extend the lead watered by the post Perenia lost possession Dembele Pedri Lovely incisive pass. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. And the keeper caught there. So the corner played into the box. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. Well, such a high degree of difficulty. Not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. And Aubameyang making the move with the ball at his feet. What's he going to do next? Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. And a poor ball. Lucas Boyer. He has time to play it over. Can he do it? And diving to thwart it. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Firing it towards goal. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how on earth he got there. And he's fired over the corner. Not the best clearance. Barcelona free kick. It'll be here. Difficult to stop him. 
did look as though they might be onto something for a second or so. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Peremilla. And that's an important intervention. Oh, good play, this. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, it has come to nothing. Peremilla. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. And teammates to play it to. And the cross blocked by Piquet. Played over. Tremendous block. The free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang, a formidable striker. No two ways about that. And. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Ferran Torres tackling and winning the ball to boot. Lucas Boyer. And there to intervene. Mascarel, a sloppy pass. Promising move from Barcelona. And let's give credit to the defending. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Lucas Boyer. Crossing possibilities. Pumbao. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Dembele. Has a go. Oh, really close. Just over the top. And a substitution in the offing. And they could face difficulties here. Mascarel. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, the free kick, lacking just a little bit of guile. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Moving it forward. Terrific block. Foul there, free kick awarded. Time for a change then. <laughs> to extend the lead here. And in it goes, as coolly as you like, never in any doubt from the spot.
Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Electing to cross into the centre. Not messing around with that clearance. This might be ideal for the counter. Deciding to go inside. Well, that was easy on the eye. And he didn't miss by much. Well, that's how to counter-attack. They did it with such pace. Just couldn't finish it off. Here it is now, a substitution. Ivan Marconi. Astore. Still alive. Corner given. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. And the substitution will occur now. Over it comes. Smuggled away. Chance, maybe. Well, they can bring it out now. Not to be advised, giving the ball away in that position. Well, knocked on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Torres. Now Jordi Alba. De Jong. Excellent passing. Clean challenge. Good thing from his point of view. Just 15 minutes remaining. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Dembele. Opportunity it is. What a save! Astore. Hosan. Gonna get a try. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how on earth he got there. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Who can they pick out? Well, did his job defensively. Spot on with that tackle. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. Now Jordi Alba. Useful looking ball. Well, it might still work out for them. And thumped away. Options in the centre. Not really the ideal clearance. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. It did look on for them, but not to be. A story. Well, they get the ball once more. De Jong. Body in the way. And he takes on the shot. 
Well, not quite accurate enough, but it was a close thing. The final whistle is sounded, and it's a victory for Barcelona. Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It's a great performance. So, fruitful as far as Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang is concerned. How would you sum up his performance? Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.